this is a video for the ladies. Ladies, if you want to stay ahead of the trend, you want to stay trendy, you want to be beyond the competition, you want to be better than all the other women, don't do what the other women are doing. And you know what's going to start being trendy right now? Being virtuous and being a good woman. This, I can promise you, this is this is a new wave. This is going to be the new trend. That whole feminism movement is dying. It's quickly. It's, whew, it's, whew. I think it's just abandoned ship. Abandoned ship. If you put your eggs and you put, you invested in the whole feminism movement, well, guess what, guys? Um, some of you women, you profited from it. You, 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 you benefited for, for, for 10, 20 years or whatever. However long that, that, that whole kind of streak went along. You benefited from that movement. Now it's time to think this movement is not working anymore. No one wants this no more. This is the new trend. This is the wave. I, I, can, I cannot go anywhere on, on YouTube without seeing this. The modern woman is trash. Don't marry in the States. Single mothers. Blah, blah, blah. I cannot get out of YouTube without seeing at least like one video per, per per page it's impossible because people have caught on what the female empowerment movement has done to the families what feminism has done feminism wasn't about equality feminism was was about coveted was about coveting power yeah that's what it was about coveting power originally you can say that yes it was about equality. And once we enter the 20th century, what, what what equality did women really have? Okay? You know what was real inequality? Racism. The blacks had it really bad. And I don't see the back the black people complaining about it. The blacks people were getting killed and murdered, and they were slaves. Women complaining about their little inequality issues? That's a joke. I'm sorry to say. African Americans, they had it really, really bad. So I understand if they're frustrated with the white people and this and that, and it, it, it makes sense because of what they did in the history. You know, they were trafficked, they were sold, they were slaves. That was real inequality. These little like uh, things that people complain about are like little subtle, um, little perk advantages. Oh, how come he gets? Ten more dollars a day than I do. Like really, really, you're gonna complain about like that little ten percent? <laughs> it's a joke, man. It really is. But anyways, ladies, good women, virtuous women. This is the new trend. This is the new wave. I promise you, ladies, if you wanna be attracting all those guys, you wanna be getting all those men. Woo, be a virtuous. Be a virtuous woman. We men, listen, it's not about your looks, ladies. We men will settle for a fucking five if she, if her personality is a ten. Do you understand that, ladies? Or even the guys? Men will settle for less when it comes to the looks if her personality is really, really, really good and genuine. Because men don't, like... Men, we, we get attracted by by her uh, female beauty. I know I am. I, I love female beauty. I think it's, it's such a beautiful thing. It's one of the uh, most beautiful thing in the world. But if she has no heart, if she has no soul, then, you know, what are you going to do with this person in the long term? How are you going to have a relationship with this person? You know? So... For the ladies watching this, you can uh, maybe go back to church, Christian or Catholic. Uh, it's funny because I feel like we're kind of going back in that direction, where religion might even come back again. We we might we might be going back to like early, what what was it? Early eighties, early nineties. I think it was like right around when I was like a little baby. The generation before me, or the decade before me, was about the traditional relationships and religion which honestly i say that they these people had it better than we did and as far as human relationship is concerned there are some perks that we have 
that are better than the old ways, which is we have more flexibility, but at what cost? I ask, at what cost? Like, what did what did we really trade? We traded female empowerment go went up, masculine masculinity went down, divorces went up, marriages declined. Uh, let me tell you, it doesn't take a genius to figure this out. Feminism and the female empowerment movement was not a good thing. It was not a good thing. If we want something concrete, we need real equality between the gender roles. Now, there's going to be slight differences in terms of equality because male and men and women are different. So there is a slight double standard because we are not the same gender. Okay? That means that our roles in life will be different. However, I don't like the double standards today are just ridiculous and crazy, but whatever. That's far despite the point. So ladies, work on being good women again. Please, save the universe. Save the planet. This is how you can... You ladies have all the power right now. So we beg you. We beg you. Go back to being good women and virtuous women again. And this, you will save the universe. <laughs> All right. And how can you be a good woman again after all these years of the, with the masculine and this and that? I guess it's kind of like practicing, but you also got to let go a little bit. You got to take breaks. Take, take, take breaks. Okay. If you are always in that masculine energy, how are you going to get in that feminine energy? Okay. Take a day off of work. Hang out with people who you who you like. You know what I'm saying? Like, do do female stuff. Just the same way that you got into that masculine energy, you can get back into that female energy. And in fact, it should be even easier because anything that is already within you will come most natural. Will just be intuitive. You just forgot how to do it. You went into a cycle. It lasted for for years. You can change shifts and i'm telling you this is a this you want to invest if you want to invest this, if you want to invest smart you want to invest in the what the trend that's popping right now this this is like this is about to explode right now the virtuous women and good women oh that's that stock has went way up and i mean that's what that's what men has been why like, that's what men has been looking for for the longest time. We men, we want a virtuous, good, beautiful, confident, well, not confident, virtuous, beautiful, and a good woman, basically. Obviously confident too, but that was not what I was trying to say in that sentence. All right, I think I said everything I want to say about this. Check me out on prosperitylifeads.com for the best tips and strategies on how to win more in life, and also check out the resources down below. They will greatly help you in all areas of your life, guaranteed.